An investigation is underway into a deadly helicopter crash that killed two people and injured four. It happened in a remote area near Prince George, and CTV News has learned everyone on board had been hired for field work by a logging company. CTV's Alyssa Tebow has our top story. A major operation to find survivors. Firefighters, the RCMP, search and rescue teams and ambulance crews all springing into action after a helicopter carrying logging contractors crashed in dense forest. It was a privately chartered uh, helicopter that was in the area doing some uh, work for a, a company that had hired them. The crash happened just before 8am near the Purden Lake ski area, about 45 minutes east of Prince George. Shortly after crews arrived, the coroner was called. Two people on board were killed. It's a tragedy that is hitting close to home, especially with two people on board uh, that are local to the area. Uh, so, you know, many of our families uh, and community members are going to be um, affected by this. The four other passengers were taken to hospital and assessed. Northern Health confirming they're all reported to be in good condition. And it's expected that some of the patients may be discharged from the hospital today. Forestry company Canfor has confirmed to CTV News it had hired the privately owned helicopter and its pilot. The passengers were also contractors heading to do field survey work. The company saying we mourn the loss of the workers whose lives were heartbreakingly cut short and send condolences to the families and friends. The question now is what went wrong? The Transportation Safety Board has taken control of the investigation and workers with the TSB are expected to arrive on scene tomorrow. Alyssa Thibault, CTV News.